idea what I'm doing around this track. I got a 58.1. Um, Just ran a couple laps right now, so uh, yeah, pretty good. I'm, I think if you can get below a minute, you'll probably be in the 50% range, better than 50% of the people here. So if you can get in this range, it'd be I mean, the fastest people might be in the 56s, but it was like the best. So it's a pretty good lap, I think. So I'm just going to show you what I did. Give you an idea. Let's see if I can get this thing to play. Pause. This lap is a lot. Sorry. This is the lap I'm doing for the top speed. So let's go back. Let's show you what I'm breaking. I think you might be able to get in a little bit deeper than I did, but I broke at about the two. See my brake thing, I'm only going about half brake power. It's shifting down to fourth, third, basically holding third during this whole corner. Just basically try to stay in this cement. You don't have to really hit this apex on the first one because it's more important to get the next one. So you're a little wide here, but stay in the cement area. So, so stay in the cement area, kind of. You want to hit this apex here and like gas all the way out. I think it was, I mean, I'm all the way over here, much track as you can get. much track as you can get get all the way out there uh, let's go back to cockpit staying in third here the whole time you can right when I'm basically uh, max RPMs here this thing. Yeah, I'm almost at a shift point here but I'm about to be off the gas in two seconds so I just stayed in third the whole time Again, this one you kind of stay a little wide and you want to hit this second. It's kind of a big sweeping turn. You want to hit this second apex. Right there. I mean, where the bumps are in that cement, you want to be in there pretty hard. I think if you can get it perfect run, you can be full throttle through here. But some of these turns like this uh, just kind of lift off the throttle. I'm not even all the way off. I'm about a third throttle. Just kind of helps you plant your nose and a little more control of the car. Get it planted. Hit that bump and then gun it as much as you can. I could have been actually probably pretty closer. Um, it's my right front. Let's see. Yeah, I could have been a little closer. I mean, I'm, this is not perfect by any means, but. Lifting off the gas just a tad to kind of plant the front so you can get a little more turn control. Get in there once you get a hit, you're full throttle. Fourth through here. And just kind of get wide here in this area. I don't even know if this is grass or like a little bit of a runoff. This little strip. If you go too much further, you get a 1x, but right on the edge. Same thing, I didn't even brake. Well, I guess it did. I, I barely touched the brake right here. I mean, I am like 10% brake. See, maybe at the most. Pretty light. Just laying off the gas, get your nose planted in this apex, and you're like back on the throttle. Wait, this is the hardest part of this track right here because you got it. This is like a major uphill, and you almost like get air and off a wheel so you've got to have your wheel straight basically got to be when you get over the top of this crest see if you can see any like airborneness on this car um maybe you've got to have your wheel straight or you'll be out of control because you're like loop you're going over this crest and wheels are like lifting off the track I see that Let's see yes yeah maybe we can get some air here you're basically taking a jump, so I mean, if you're not straight, 
you don't have your wheels straight by the time you get to the top of this hill, you're going to be in trouble. It's hard to control it. So, I mean, I'm full throttle here. If I maybe don't hit this perfectly and you're running a little wide, just off throttle to keep your, to help you get your nose planted. Just be straight right here. You go over this crest, you get a little air. You don't feel like you're losing control, but good. Again, stay wide here. I'm staying in fourth. Here, I tried third, but I felt like I was just like, right when I got back in the gas, it was time to shift. So, fourth. Here. I only went, I mean, I barely break in here. I'm about a third break, maybe. Let's see where I'm starting. I'm third break. Slow down just a little bit. Just enough, slowing down just enough to get your nose planted in this corner. I think I'm getting on this corner. You can see the car lifts up pretty big, but that's fine. No 1X there, so. Just enough brake to get, I mean, you barely need to slow down. Just got to get it enough control so you can get the car pointed towards the apex. And full throttle. If you get a really good run, you might be able to get into fifth before you get to this turn, but I couldn't get it. I think I did it last night, maybe, but. And again, I'm coming off the throttle just a hair here. I think if you get a perfect run, maybe you can stick it full throttle, but it's pretty tough. But I'm 100%. I mean, I'd just come off the throttle a little bit, get the just enough to get the nose planted in the like apex. I'm not even it's very barely coming off the gas. Ride that bump, just go. I mean, I could have. I think I could have took that more because I could have used up more of this track. Top speed about 117, so uh, let me just run it. I'll let you look at it. Full speed. So here we go, just one lap. Stay wide. Both those first two turns, you kind of stay wide in the first apex. Just hit the second one because that's the one you need to hit going off the straight afterwards. Just be straight there. It's tough if you're not straight. said pretty easy uh let me i got one that i crashed lap one probably let's up that hill up there crashes i mean if you don't get straight on this part right here if you're not i think i've got a pretty good run here i thought but i came a little bit wide i was a little bit wide coming off this too much speed, probably. I should have probably backed off here and tried to correct it. I just didn't get straight fast enough. You're like losing air, you're not straight, your wheels come down, it's just hard to control. At that point, I should have backed off, I was just trying to save it. But that's the hardest part of this track, really. Um, it's pretty easy other than that. Let me look in this car real quick. Let me see something, let me go back into the screen. I just want to see what my optimal lap was. I only ran like four laps, so I could probably have gotten it down a little bit. I got an optimal of 57.8, so I mean, it's definitely I could get faster. I ran my best lap, 57.8, but this is a 58.1. Just give you something to look at, get an idea. So, that's it.